Welcome to part two of Let's Play Not Final Fantasy 2. And we are basically heading towards the boss. I'm just going to ignore most of the battles here for a reason. Okay, that's a pretty high encounter rate. I can be able to beat the boss just fine at the levels I'm at, I'm pretty sure, as long as I'm smart about things. And honestly, I kind of want to get to certain points sooner rather than later. Oh, my character's invisible. Okay, this might be a problem. Wasn't expecting there to be issues with the emulation stuff. Oh, well. So it's not fun. The boys. I really hope this gets fixed in other dungeons. Honestly, only reason I can tell where I am is basically based upon where the fane is moving. I think the problem is this thing can't handle too many layers. So if the myth itself makes the character invisible. Yeah, I'm just gonna fight this battle. That why like there's a funny thing about some games. In some games, you can win a random battle in a single hit. Your characters will be like, once X dead, one X dead. Other times, it takes like several hits just to see a single enemy in the game. It's just the nature of life. Well, and we're almost there. I like going away. Leave now. No. No, it's a puppy. Of course I do. We've got fruit cake. I never realized how much the village of Mist was against fruit cake. This boss isn't much trouble at all as long as you time things right. It's just a matter of not attacking at the wrong time. I can probably get most of his HP taken care of before he even does this special trick. And for this part... Parry? Mm, wait, wait... Mm, not yet. Now. That worked.
Yeah, most of the time, it usually only gets to go to mid for maybe two or three times at most. And you only gotta do it once. That's the problem when you do your special thing way too late. And now, we have a package to deliver, but before that... This stuff. Yeah, I know. But people have played this game before a hundred times. Alright, this better equipment again anyway. Of course, let's check our items. Package. I kind of like the name Package better for this, because in some games, the um, package is called things like Bomb Rain, or something that indicates it's not a good thing. It's kind of like taking poison, a package labeled poison into a club and being told to pour into drinks. You're asking for something bad to happen. At least we call it a pack, and you can tell the season's not being idiotic. Yeah. What begs the question? When I mean, you face a ton of bomb enemies in Final Fantasy games, but they usually don't do this much damage, they tend to be centralized. Which begs the question, does being in a random battle weaken the power of a monster? Are they stronger in cutscenes? Yeah, there are no summoners in this game, they're callers. And, you know the fun part? This never becomes a plot point ever again in the Final Fantasy series. There's never anything that I know about people dying after summons or defeated. Heck, most of the time when you summon a monster, it just appears and then vanishes after you summon it. And in this one case, you can kill it, and you kill someone else. So it basically takes a burnt down village to convince Cecil that something has to be done. Rescue Rosa. Well, it doesn't make sense. I mean, she is still in bear, and if you consider again someone out of a bad place to be rescued, even if she is in no danger yet from anything. Please come with us, the people who burned down your village and killed your mother. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's defeat her in battle. Oh, come on. We have a time to attack her once. In the past, I have actually been able to attack her. Yeah, she is. I wish they didn't have a service no button to cause the text to move forward. But simply, he basically said, I can't stay here any longer. I need to find a safe place for her. And all that jazz. Let's just one. 
good rule of thumb when grinding a game like this is to look at how fast you gain levels. The faster you gain levels, the more likely you should level up. Sorry about the text that went by too fast. Sometimes I forget, as I said before, the almost every single button seems to activate things. Next time on Let's Play Not Final Fantasy 2, we will basically take a rest and figure out what her name is. As if we didn't already know. So, bye for now.